Hi everyone, my name is Andrew Butterfield. I'm the Senior Product Manager at Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, responsible for our high-performance computing and GPUs. Today I'll be presenting on our expanding GPU offering. Oracle has teamed up with NVIDIA from the beginning with our first release of the Tesla P100 GPU at Oracle Open World in 2017. The Tesla P100 GPU gave Oracle's massive customer base access to GPU-accelerated computing in the cloud. With this new offering, our customers could begin to harness the power of GPU-enabled rendering, AI, accelerated analytics, and high-performance computing. This gave our customers like Yellow Dog that provide 3D rendering solutions a huge leap forward. Our bare metal NVIDIA P100 GPU offering was 10 times faster than their on-premises solution. It was more than twice as fast as AWS and cost less overall. These performance and cost gains allowed them to scale their business and offer their solution at a more competitive price. We're one of the first people I understand to be using the Oracle Bare Metal Cloud uh, and our benchmarking test with the Oracle Bare Metal Cloud compared to the fastest nodes we're getting from some of the other providers was at minimum two times faster and at best 9.8 times faster. Well, what that means is we can offer this kind of super fast computer power and super fast rendering then to our customers, uh, which then means that they can either get their jobs done faster, which means we can charge a premium price for that, um, or we can surprise and kind of delight them really with uh, getting their jobs done before they expected they were going to be done. Six months later, we took it up a notch and released the NVIDIA Tesla V100, giving customers access to the only bare metal GPU server with eight GPUs interconnected by NVIDIA's high-speed NVLink and built on top of our high-performance cloud, which provides an industry-leading networking stack and NVMe block storage. With this, we also released access to the NVIDIA GPU cloud so that researchers and data scientists could easily access a wide range of GPU-optimized software tools for deep learning and HPC. At the same time, we released NVIDIA Grid for GPU accelerated graphics on Oracle Cloud infrastructure so that creative and technical professionals can maximize their productivity from anywhere by accessing the most demanding professional design and engineering applications from the cloud. With the NVIDIA V100 GPU being over six times faster than for previous generations and priced below all other cloud service providers at $2.95 per GPU per hour, we again delivered the best performance at the best price. The new platform added new opportunities to solve challenges in novel ways. National Grid ESO needed machine learning models to handle the complexity of accurately predicting the renewable energy available at any given moment. For example, instead of estimating the power from just a few hundred big power plants, there are now millions of generation sources, with each solar panel and wind turbine exhibiting its own distinct behavior. National Grid ESO needed lightning fast computing power for very short bursts to run these complex machine learning models. Running on Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, National Grid ESO saw up to a 40% in performance improvement. Running on Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, National Grid ESO saw up to a 40% performance improvement. When the team ran its first machine learning model on Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, it was also about 40% more accurate than the previous model in production at that time. The team expected the workload to take a few hours to run, but instead ran in minutes. Using Oracle Cloud Infrastructure to predict energy supply, Great Britain hit a historic milestone, producing 48.5% of its electricity from renewable resources the 12 months ending in December 2019. At National Grid ESO, we have a very specific mission, which is to ensure that everyone in GB gets power when they need it. We operate like the motorway network of the electricity grid within the UK. The area that I look after looks at using machine learning to accurately predict renewables so we can lower the carbon footprint of the UK energy system. To give you an example, the generators have gone from hundreds of generation sources to literally millions in the last decade. Each of them have their own distinct behaviours, some of which we control uh, through a control centre, some of which are purely weather dependent in the case of, say, solar or some of the wind. So our job is to try and predict that as accurately as you can, and that's where the machine learning tech really pays its corn. Before the current OCI solution that we use for machine learning, we used more classical Oracle databases to analyze the information. OCI was the first to come out with the new NVIDIA Tesla cloud solution. If you look at the tensor cores, they run around about 125 teraflops. And even so, even at full chat, they only use about 300 watts of energy, which is maybe a tenth of my kettle at home. It allows us to run models and data sets far in advance of anything we've done before. It allows us to see patterns that we couldn't see before. It allows us to see patterns in data that are not obvious to humans. 
The first version that uh, we actually produced with the machine learning was around about 40% more accurate than the previous version that was in production at that time. I remember the first time we ran a really good GPU query on it and we were expecting it to take maybe a few hours and it ran in minutes and we thought it hadn't actually executed but it had. It's a really big improvement. Oracle just works. You can trust it. Now, as of September 30th, we're offering our customers even greater performance at the unbeatable price of $3.05 per GPU per hour. With this, customers can now access the new NVIDIA Ampere A100 on Oracle Cloud infrastructure well before anyone can access it on-premise. The new bare metal instance, GPU 4.8, features eight NVIDIA A100 Tensor Core GPUs with 40 gigabytes of memory each, all interconnected via NVIDIA and VLink. The CPU on board has 64 physical cores of AMD ROM processors running at 2.9 GHz with a boosted frequency of 3.4 GHz supported. It's also equipped with 2 TB of RAM and 24 TB of NVMe storage. This new bare metal GPU instance joins the high-speed, low-latency cluster network architecture, enabling customers to scale to over 500 GPU clusters for large-scale distributed workloads requiring RDMA and providing up to 1.6 terabytes of bandwidth per bare metal node. The NVIDIA A100 GPU delivers incredible performance, with up to six times the performance for natural language processing workloads compared to the V100, and two to four times the performance for HPC workloads, further enabling AI models to take on increasingly more complex workloads faster and with greater accuracy. As with our previous GPUs, this will be offered as a bare metal server to provide the highest level of performance for VMs following along shortly. With this next step in Oracle Cloud Infrastructure's NVIDIA GPU offering, we're anticipating the next great innovations from our customers. With an out-of-the-box performance improvement of six times compared to the V100 GPU for natural language processing workloads like BERT, which train against the entire English Wikipedia dataset of 2.5 billion words, we are enabling computers to understand immense amounts of text, which enables closer, more natural interactions between humans and computers. In the realm of health sciences, this new platform can help to identify cancerous cells that are undetectable to the human eye and could enable diagnoses before the patient even leaves their appointment. The next generation GPU instance provides the right platform and exceptional price performance for manufacturers to explore and evaluate designs quickly to build safer and higher quality products faster. OCI provides a better GPU platform than other clouds because we offer true bare metal. Other cloud providers may market bare metal. However, there is often some form of hypervisor overhead, or it is not a single tenant offering, meaning it isn't dedicated to you. We offer true bare metal without the hypervisor layer and without any Oracle software installed. We provide just the infrastructure so you can connect to it and configure it as you would an on-premises server. For storage, we offer 6.4 terabytes of local NVMe SSD storage, which is more than any other cloud provider. For customers that need additional storage, we offer elastic block storage volumes, which can provide up to 32 terabytes each and up to 35,000 IOPS per volume. Lastly, we have shown that our parallel file system have a higher throughput than other cloud providers, with OCI recently placing seventh on the IO500. OCI provides a specialized network that is not oversubscribed, so you won't be getting a lot of noisy neighbors affecting your performance. It's also a flat network with 25 gigabit per second bandwidth and is the only cloud with a network performance SLA. We guarantee that your resource performance should be greater than 90% of the published performance 99% of the time. Lastly, we also provide a 100 gigabit per second RDMA network to run tightly coupled workloads across clusters of GPU 4.8 nodes. We know that it's not enough to just have the best hardware. To get the best performance, you also need a wide GPU ecosystem of supported frameworks, software, and images. That's why we've curated an array of partnerships with companies such as Ansys, Kinetica, and NVIDIA, along with testing frameworks such as PyTorch and TensorFlow so that you have the tools needed to get the job done. Try it out for yourself and spin up a GPU on Oracle Cloud and get started running your AI workloads on the fastest and least expensive NVIDIA A100 GPU in the cloud. Thank you for your time.